All right, I'm with Derek Ariniak from Winnipeg, Manitoba, and he's the second on the youth Olympic team. Uh, how did you get started in curling? Uh, my parents got me into it at a pretty young age. My dad ran the Little Rock League at a local club, so I was out there throwing and stuff when, when I was about four or five. Mm -hmm. What kind of experiences have you uh, had so far? What events have you been to? Uh, well, the Canada Games was probably the biggest. Uh, my team got bronze there. But also, we were in the Junior Provincials last year. We came fourth. And then when I was younger, um, my team, we came second in the 13 and under Provincials. And we won the 14 and under Manito uh, MCA Youth Bonds Field. So that was a pretty big accomplishment for me at that age. So through the entire application process, what did you think your chances were? I had no idea. I mean, I thought there was going to be a lot of kids, and so I didn't really give myself that big of a chance. But I thought, you know, I have something to put for everything, so I might as well fill it out, and maybe I'll get lucky. <laughs> and what was, what was your thought when, uh, when you got the call? I was just over the top. I ran outside, did a couple laps around my bay. Like, I could not handle it. I was just, like, I was jumping off the walls for the next two days straight. <laughs> so when you're not curling, what, uh, what kind of stuff do you do? Uh, I, I play hockey and a lot of other sports, like golf in the summer, and play badminton, run cross country. So I'm usually keeping pretty active with sports. Mm -hmm. And as far as role models in curling, is there an athlete or a particular curler you look up to or you, you mm -hmm. really enjoy following? I'd probably say I look up to Jeff Stoughton a lot just because Coming from Winnipeg, I'll see him all the time at the club and stuff, and just me able to see him and be like, wow, like that's a world champion right there, and like he's just hanging around Winnipeg, like that could be me one day. <laughs> so other than uh, professional curlers or athletes, has, has, there, any been, has there been anybody who's uh, really influenced you through your curling career? Definitely my parents. I mean, they actually met through curling, so it definitely runs in the family. My dad's a pretty high-level curler. He's in the select most years. And just them teaching me like how to play the game and stuff like that has really helped me along. And finally, what are you looking forward to most about your trip to uh, Austria? Just competing against all different countries. Wearing the maple leaf on the back, I mean, it's something that every kid in Canada that curls dreams of. So having that experience is going to be just amazing. All right, well, good luck, and we'll, uh, we'll keep an eye on how it goes. Thank you.